Hello. So here's the setup we've got. Back here, the angle of elevation is 25 degrees up to the top of the mountain. They move 2,000 feet closer and get an angle of 29 degrees. Well, if we let this whole distance from the 25 for the 25 degree angle equal x, the distance from the mountain to where they did the 29 degree angle has to be x minus 2,000 because it's 2,000 feet closer. So we have tangent of 25 is going to equal h divided by x. Okay. And we also have the tangent of 29 is going to equal h over x minus 2,000, okay? So, since we want to find H, let's solve these equations for X. So I'm going to put X, I'm going to multiply, for the first one, I'm going to multiply X times both sides. I get X times a tangent of 25 degrees has to equal h, and then I divide both sides by tangent of 25, I get x equals h divided by the tangent of 25. For the other one, I'm going to multiply both sides by x minus 2,000, and get x minus 2,000 times tangent of 29 equals h. Like that. Then I'm going to divide both sides by the tangent of 29. And I get x minus 2,000 equals h divided by the tangent of 29. Then I'm going to add 2,000 to get x by itself. Now, since x has to equal itself, we can set these two equations equal to each other. I get h over tangent of 25 equals h over 2,000 tangent of 29. Okay. So now, let's figure out what tangent of 25 is. Oh, this is plus. That's plus. I didn't think that looked right. Plus h over tangent of 29. Okay, so let's get our h's on the same side. I get h tangent of 25 minus h tangent of 29 has to equal 2,000. Well, let's factor out our h. I get h times 1 over tangent of 25 minus 1 over tangent of 29 has to equal 2,000. Now we can divide both sides by what's in the parentheses here, and we get h equals 2,000 divided by 1 over tangent of 25 
minus 1 over tangent of 29, which would equal 2,000 divided by, let me get my calculator. Make sure I'm in degree mode. 1 divided by the tangent of 25 equals minus 1 divided by tangent of 29 equals, and I get that's going to be over point three four zero five when I round off to a couple decimal places. And then I take 2,000 divided by that, and I get 5,874.420 feet. So there's our answer. Thank you.